season. The duck sold out last time and actually it looks almost a little bit more like a goose <laughs> than a duck. But anyway, we've got several different things. The fox is brand new. Foxy. <laughs> we've got <laughs> Foxy Loxy. That's right. And Goosey Lucy Goosey, right? <laughs> Here's the fox. Mm -hmm. Look how cute that Ugh. is. Brand new. Here is what we're calling the duck but I think it's probably a little more like a goose. Um, then we have the owl. Mm-hmm. Ooh. Oh, wise old owl Ooh. there. <laughs> would go well with the other, the pumpkin holders, it our would, owl. exactly. And then there is the bunny rabbit. Aww. And it, they all have light that lights up. Yes. Tell me a little bit about this, first of all. So Plow and Hearth created these so that they have, you have something peaceful and calm, but fun also in your garden. Plow and Hearth does an awesome job with animals and particularly the faces. So we'll go through them again and mm. just, you can see those beautiful faces. Yeah. But they have these sort of that, think of them fanciful, going out into the garden and capturing fireflies. And that's mm. what they've done. They've got this little jar of like Aww. fireflies in their little either wings or paws. And so they've captured Captured those and so those will light up because these are battery powered so they're six hours on 18 hours off hmm. but I'm gonna swing little little goose or duck here around <laughs> so you can see how beautifully textured wow. and done they are mm -hmm. these are carved by hand and then they are cast in resin so that they can be fine to be used outside but you know as the winter as the weather starts getting colder I yeah. like using these maybe on a covered porch mm -hmm. or inside where I'm going to see them. Yes. But if right. you want to use them out in your garden, you can. Look so how there's cute our darling that fox. fox. Is. And once again, when you see them, you know, I mean, they're so three dimensional. Mm -hmm. And also the fact that you can see all of that texture that they've done and the painting. And notice how it's not just all one color, it's shaded to yes. give you the highs and lows in there first. So that's the fox. These are all going to be somewhere around 10 to 12 inches high. Mm -hmm. Look at this owl. Oh. Oh, it wait beautiful. till you see the back yeah. of him. Oh, he is absolutely gorgeous. So look at all that detail on the feathers and even all the way down to his tail. All those beautiful feathering. And to me, the magic happens when it gets dark at night because those mm. lights are going to glow just like they had caught fireflies yeah. in a jar. And there's the bunny rabbit. Take yeah. a look at that. Oh, so cute. So cute. And I like how you, you even lifted a couple of them mm -hmm. up on just a little slice of wood. A slice of wood, yeah. Kind of thing. So it's so nice. And by the way, the um, batteries go in the bottom. Right, right. There right? is a battery um, like compartment on the bottom. Mm -hmm. So yeah. you can go ahead and just um, t put the batteries in under there. And there we go. You're going to, oh, look at how that glow. It's oh. so pretty. And they're, you know, they're just so cute, tucked into they flowers, are. tucked into your, you know, front porch, mm -hmm. maybe with the mums or whatever you have. Yeah. Really cheerful. Here's the other thing I want to mention is that there is, it's actually $29.98. But if you have a cute card, use that and you can break it down into three monthly payments of about $10 a month if you'd like to do that. So, and if you don't have a cute card, feel free to go to qbc.com and apply for one and if you are actually um, approved yet today you will get a $20 e-gift card in the e in your email uh, for a future purchase at some point but I just also thought too this we should all be looking ahead to gifts mm -hmm. because we like a lot of times we'll know somebody that loves to decorate with geese mm -hmm. or owls yes. or rabbits or fox or anything like that this is the time to do it. These are exquisitely done. Yes. I want to go back to something about plow and hearth. You yes. said how beautifully they do the faces. Yes, exactly. And that's artistry. It is, it is. You know, they take great care to make sure that they look realistic, even though this is sort of fanciful, thinking that, you know, they're yeah. capturing the fireflies. But to look at them, let's take a look yeah. at our little fox there. He's closing his eyes. He's just mm -hmm. like so happy and just something that, you know, he cut those fireflies in the jar. But look how that jar is just lighting up his face too. And just like a little smile, just great details. And we look over maybe at our little Little, uh, duck or goose here and this kind of reminds me of one of those storybook characters that you yes. would read in the book so it's fun mm -hmm. also to involve your children in mm -hmm. these because they're going to be able to name them maybe they would like to place them around your garden or up in your front porch with some flowers get or them involved about, in decorating what about in their bedroom as a uh, night light you, you certainly could that you would could be put a great it idea. on the bedroom mm -hmm. dresser with it as a night light which would be so really fun, darling too. yes a lot of people are ordering the owl 
and the owl mm -hmm. is a, another great piece to be able to have. You could even set it like, let's say maybe you've got a kind of a stump yes. of sort that That'd you haven't cute. ground down when you cut mm -hmm. the tree down and you could put the owl right on the stump. Wouldn't that look cute? <laughs> That's a great idea. I like it. And then we have the bunny rabbit. Mm -hmm. Now most of us, the rabbits eat our flowers and we're not too thrilled about it. But this one won't this one eat won't. the flowers. Right. <laughs> I like that. It'll be a good rabbit. <laughs> It'll, It'll be a good one. <laughs> it won't eat your flowers. It won't eat your plants, but it's just yeah. adorable and darling. Um, yeah. You know, any one that you get, you can have a little menagerie here. Yeah. They're peaceful. They're very sweet. Mm. I love the lighting aspect to them. And, right. you know, I've had some of our uh, viewers ask if we've ever had a fox, if we had foxes coming up. There's one yeah. gal, Susan, who's been asking for two years, oh. when are you having a fox? So Susan, here it Today's is. Today's the day, and this is our final order of the season. By the way, you can only get these at QVC. You cannot get these elsewhere. So that's why you wanna make sure you get them. And here's the other thing. Like, let's say you picked up the owl, or the fox, or the rabbit, or the um, uh, duck, and you wanna put something else in the garden around it, these mushrooms are what I would recommend because those mushrooms are so beautiful. They're really like, um, works of art. It really reminds me of stained glass windows. Yeah, they're And beautiful. they are stunning. We had them a year ago and they blew out the door. So I'm going to tell you right now, when we get there, that could be a very busy moment. You might want to get ahead of everybody else. Okay, <clears throat> wall art. You know, people are creating outdoor rooms mm -hmm. of their home rather than adding on for $50,000 mm -hmm. to add on another room.